with the Holy Spirit inside of you, you are never home alone. Top of the morning to you. So the Holy Spirit is the third person of the triune God. 1 John 5, 7, there's the Father, the Word, the Holy Spirit. There's three in one. John 1, 14 explains the Word became flesh and dwelt among us, speaking about Jesus. So that's where that, it says the Father, the Word, Jesus, and Holy Spirit. So trying to describe Holy Spirit and what he does for us is sort of like, um, quenching your thirst with a fire hose. It's just too much and overwhelming sometimes. But we're going to try to scratch the surface here. So how do we get the Holy Spirit? Luke eleven thirteen. 13, Holy Spirit can be given by the Father to those that ask. Acts 1, 5, we can get baptized with the Holy Spirit. Acts 4, 31, at Pentecost, all were filled by the Holy Spirit. Acts 8, 17, Holy Spirit can be received by the laying on of hands. Acts 10, 44, Holy Spirit can fall on those who hear the word of God. Luke 1, 41, Elizabeth, the mother of John the Baptist, was filled with the Holy Spirit. So once received, what can we expect from Holy Spirit? Acts 1, 5, Holy Spirit gives us power to witness to others about Jesus. Acts 4, 31, Holy Spirit helps us to speak God's word in boldness. Acts 9, 31, Holy Spirit gives us comfort. Romans 5, 5, Holy Spirit pours out God's love within our hearts. Romans 5, 15, 13, Holy Spirit gives us hope. I'm just getting, it, it's getting in me. I'm, I'm feeling the Holy Spirit right now. 1 Corinthians 2, 13, Holy Spirit teaches us. Titus 3, 5, Holy Spirit can renew us. Hebrews 2, 4, Holy Spirit can give us gifts like love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control. 2 Peter 1, 21, Holy Spirit can move men to speak. Jude 1, 20, we can pray in the Holy Spirit. Acts 1, 16, Holy Spirit can speak out of our mouths. Ephesians 4, 30, Holy Spirit is very sensitive and he can be grieved. Um, 1 Corinthians 6, 19, Holy Spirit resides in our bodies. So be encouraged today. This same Holy Spirit that was in Jesus is in us. And like uh, Jesus said in John 16, 32, Jesus speaking to his friends, you will leave me alone, yet I am not alone, for the Father is with me. You are never home alone when you have the Holy Spirit. Have a great day.